most beautiful to heaven. heaven we've ever seen. When we go towards the light, it's gonna be all right, even though it may be rain. When you go towards the light, it's gonna be all right. Life can be scary when you don't know the forecast. take a picture in front of a Prada store in the middle of nowhere in the middle of nowhere oh we have a selfie stick in the car oh let's get it yeah. it's a fake Prada store but there's real Prada inside of it and it's it's like a really cool destination that people like to go and take pictures in front of um, so Instagram and we met the nicest people when London hung up a yarn bomb two girls that were representative us. of us <laughs> when we met this family, Martha's so small, we were kind of on the same timetable. And we drove at the same time to like this great restaurant in Marfa where there was music and dancing. <laughs> And people. Oh. <laughs> we thought it was going to be a quiet night, finally able to relax a little bit, watch The Bachelor. Nope. <laughs> We drove to the Marfa Lights. We've been hearing a lot about the Marfa Lights. Apparently they're the thing to do in Marfa. Yep. We had no idea what to expect and we don't really have video footage because, because it's so dark. Kind of dark. Wow. Oh, you can't see it in the film. I got a little. I didn't expect that. Apparently they were the most active they've been that night in 40 years. There were lots of little red and green and yellow lights. Yeah, and we listened to some podcasts about it and some people believe and others think they're just cars driving down the highway. So it's up to you to decide. Yes. And then we drive two more hours because we had to. Yep. We couldn't stay in Marfa because it was booked. Booked. We're just in our heads right now, big time. London got pulled over. I got a ticket. And and then we're driving and lights are behind us. And um, it was just like an ambulance. Or something. We're just like freaking out because it's really late. And like, don't want to get pulled over at this hour. Again. <laughs> we drove two hours to a tiny little town and, and ugh, kind it, of. Um, there was literally a car parked and their license plate said boogeyman this was a creepy hotel and the boogeyman pulled in was parked right there uh yeah we won't be staying at a creepy place like this again because of the boogeyman you have to understand right it's like i've we... never seen a license plate that says boogeyman no and most people haven't seen a car that is covered in crochet so, so, okay. Yeah. The next morning we had, we took advantage of our free little breakfast. Yes. And we headed to Austin. So follow along, subscribe, click here, click here, click there. Tune in later. Yep. We'll Check be back here. with the next video. If Just, you like it, tell us. Yep. Thumbs us up. Thumbs and up. comment.